back in our area, a show of unity and solidarity in San Francisco today. Leaders from the Bay Area's black and Asian community uh, gathered with the district attorney to denounce hate and violence in the wake of three race related mass shootings nationwide. Here's NBC Bay Area's Christy Smith. My heart 100% of course goes out to all of the families and victims of the violence that happened most recently in Buffalo, New York. Board of Supervisors President Shimon Walton stood on the steps of City Hall with other elected officials and some of the area's most prominent community leaders. He denounced the hate-fueled mass shooting in Buffalo, New York, where 10 people were killed by a gunman who admits to targeting a black community. We have to teach anti-hate in our schools. We have to teach anti-hate in our communities and our places of worship. To stand united with the Asian, the black, and all communities. Reverend Amos Brown, Acknowledge pastor with the historic Third Baptist of Church, Lord. spoke Every of the need for unity. Normalized. But if we come together and stay together, we will conquer this violence of hate and racism. The group also denounced other recent shootings in the country. District Attorney Chase Boudin, who's facing a recall election in a matter of weeks, also addressed the crowd. It's horrific. It's unacceptable. We cannot allow it to happen. When we remembered Atlanta, Georgia, it was not long ago when we remember what happened in El Paso. In each of these cases, the perpetrators sought out spaces of support, of resilience, of care for our elderly and for our women and families of color. For the crowd that gathered, it's a message they say more people need to hear. I really feel that divided we fall and we seem like we're falling and I want to be on the side of standing together. In San Francisco, Christy Smith, NBC Bay Area News.